Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. I'm Miss Lisa, and this is my YouTube channel where we talk about everything I want to, science and math. And this is our final video, calculator video for Algebra 2. Yay, we made it. But there's lots more you can learn about your calculator, so keep learning. It's a key to doing good on the SAT, the ACT, and college math classes. Now, we're going to be graphing trigon trigon trigonometric, I can say it, functions. And I'm going to show you two different ways to do it. All right, so we're going to turn on our calculator. On our last video, we were doing the parametric, so just make sure you've put your calculator back on function for your mode. Now go to y equals, and I'm going to show you two different ways to do it. The one way they showed you how to do it is to show to the, to graph all of these at once. I'm going to show you first how to graph them separate. So they want you to graph y equals a sine x, and they want a to be 1, 2, and 4. So we could just put it in. 1 sine x, uh, 2 sine x and 4 sine x and we can compare it okay now they uh, uh, for your viewing window you need to go to zoom trig um number seven will give you a good window there and there's the first one, the second one, and the third one. They're hard to see. They're real light, but they're there. The first one's blue, and then you see the red one. Then you see, I can't tell what that is. Is that green? The real light dot, dotted lines there, all right? Now, but at least they're different colors, so you can separate them. Now we're going to delete these. We're going to clear these out. And I'm going to show you how the book says that you can do them all at once to compare them. So what we're going to do is we're going to do second comma, I mean second per beginning parentheses. We're about to use comma. And we're going to list the different ones. So we're going to do one and then uh, comma, two, comma, and four. Second in parentheses sine x and now it's going to do the same thing but you only have to put it in one time and they're all going to be blue first one second one third one Ta -da! there they are all right so we graph some trigonomic functions and we saw that when you increase the value of a the uh little waves get bigger the amplitude increases all right, so that's pretty fun. Fancy math, pretty fun there. Um, uh, so uh, my graph didn't look as good as that, but I think theirs didn't either, because when they did this book, it was they really only used two at TI-82s and threes, and those weren't color. So, um, you know, they just illustrated what they thought it would look like if, you, if it was in color. All right, so... Um, uh, like, share, subscribe. Math is great. And come back and do another class with me. All right. See you soon.